that's the first thing he's got to do. He is, and you know. Oh, whoa, whoa. Pasternak is around. Wow. Well, no, no, no contact. So no damage. Got some con some damage on the left rear. Looks like somebody might have got into him and helped uh, help get that car pointed towards the infield. We're gonna stay green. Nope. Now the yellow comes out. Yeah, right, and right now, you know, Kobe's got his strategy. He's got to do what he's got to do, and Boston, yours got his, and, and his is to be up front and lead. Oh, he looks like he got a little help from Salamito. And, Ray, I also thought I saw Patrick Emerling dive for pit road. There he is at yeah. the top. See him up there? And he was right up the front. Yeah, okay. Looks like Timmy got loose getting down underneath Pastriak and, and corrected, got up into him. I don't think that was anything that looked intentional. Well, Pasiak's headed to pit road, Derek. There's Kobe with Pitcat behind him in the one. Pitcat in, uh, in, again, in Eddie Harvey's number one. They've been together now two or three weeks. They're starting to really, whoa, wow. Oh, that my. Looks, is this Talladega? Holy wow. cow, that's a bunch of cars. Putting them in there in the 77. Looks like Calvin Carroll in the 25. Oh, okay. that's Bonsignor's Kyle 22. Bonsignor. He's just going to collect everybody, isn't he? Oh, man, it's just, you know, it looks like there was a little bit of contact. You know, you contact the right front, it turned it down towards the infield and got in that grass. And once he got in that grass, you know, he, he was done. Yeah, just a little bit of right front contact points the car towards the infield. Watch this. And then he just trying to save it. Boy, well, let me tell you, in that grass, not a lot of traction. That could have been a lot worse than it was, Ralph. I didn't see super heavy contact. Uh, uh, not, not, a, not a ton of... Uh, of, of hard hits there, but, uh, you know, probably some hurt feelings and some bent tie rods. So the 12 of J.R. Bertuccio involved in that. Boy, there's a lot of bent up bars in there. Well, the first big incident of the afternoon here in Thompson, and it comes early in the Sunoco World Series 150. He's going down inside. Let's see if he can pull that off. Oh, that wow. was tight. He pulled, he, you know, that Hospital gave him a little bit of a break there. Uh, he, he was kind of coming through it. Not fun to touch wheels at those speeds uh, with an open wheel car. But we see Goodale going down under. Maybe oh, Hospital. Caution. Oh, 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 boy. Anthony Osella, you know, uh, pretty hard hit there. That uh, was probably going to end the day for that car. See him moving around. Window net down. Driver's okay. You see the Nerf bar crashed in against the concrete there, and that's what those things do. Just just take a little bit of that impact away. Again, got, might have been an engine problem or something turned that car around pretty quick on him, uh, Ralph. Some, something happened there. Well, he's out of the car. Yeah, we still see a little bit of smoke coming out of that engine compartment. Something, uh, something uh, I think, uh, besides... Monsignor continuing to rack up the lap's leg going to need as many as he can get here today. Timmy Salamito trying to hold off Bobby Santos. Santos, remember, fell back to the system. He's trying to make up the lost ground. Meanwhile, trouble turn two. Andrew Krause in the 75 car. Chris Pastriak getting together. Caution flag is out for the fourth time. It's Chris Pastriak pointing the wrong direction in the 75 car. Andrew Krause, the pole sitter, pointing the right direction, but not where he wants to be. Yeah, Pastor Yak can see the whites of Krause's eyes as uh, the second incident for the 75 of Chris Pastor Yak, and this one finds him embedded into the wall between turns one and two. So uh, the amazing development, Doug Kobe, after being uh, demoted to 29th place, is now in 11th. Ride hunting, and he's been looking for a ride in the last 24 hours. And a good run today will help him find a 2020 season ride. And that's over the bottom line score. Yeah, that's really a shame, Derek, because oh, his caution comes out. Calvin Carroll. Calvin Carroll. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, I was, I was couldn't tell from the back there, but I it knew it was. Uh, 
not at the right angle it was supposed to be. I would say Calvin is done for today looking at the right front damage there, um, Ralph. But again, going back to Timmy Salomito, sorry to hear that, and, and really should thank Eric Sanderson for everything he's done for Modified Racing uh, throughout the years. You know they didn't get the uh, have the season that they want. Let's see if we can see what happened to Calvin. Calvin here. He just got up into the wall and oh, contact, got loose. Oh, yeah. I guess he didn't hit the wall. No, it looks like he had contact with another car, so we've probably got another car out there with damage. Uh, 